What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. So for today what I wanted to do was take you guys through a pretty massive winner's haul. So we just got back from brunch. We did a little bit of shopping after we ate and we got like we had like mimosas and stuff. It was beautiful and we stopped by and I honestly did pretty freaking well so it's very outdoorsy summer themed of a haul so if you guys want to see that then just keep watching all right so i wanted to take you guys through a little bit of a shop with me as well when i was in home goods winners i stumbled upon all of these ray dunn garden pieces and i just kind of lost my mind and i just thought what if i could have all of this in the three season porch so andre went and got a cart because it got serious so i was thinking maybe a citronella candle could be good and i loved all of just the tone on tone so like the white rope and the very you know clean and organized look so i actually needed a watering can i don't know if i'm going to use a watering can to plant a plant in it and just make it cute or to actually use it to water my plants. The birdhouses were super cute. The There was these little canisters that I guess you could put like a succulent in. So I was really trying to decide like what would be the best fit because there was so many and I can't get everything, but I sure as heck did get a lot. I was so excited. <laughs> and yes, we were shopping with our masks. So masks are mandatory where we are. And I got these really cute little tie-dye ones from Forever 21 that match my little tie-dye rompers. And I found a little napkin holder also that I liked. I, I found a ton of planters, so freaking cute. And then the smaller planters, I was thinking I could put maybe some succulents from Michael's in those so that I don't actually have to keep everything alive because that is, you know, know your strengths. It's not what I'm good at, but maybe this will encourage me to do so. So this was, you know, the things are happening it was a good shopping spree. We were, and this was just one aisle. So I was trying to figure out if I should get some plants from the store while I was there. And I started going through all of the candles. Like I still hadn't left that aisle. And then I started looking at pillows. So I got really cute pillows off of Amazon that are like very boho style. And they had similar ones like tassel and that like boho look. So I have gray ones and I have beige ones in our porch and on our balcony, which go super well. So I was trying to see if they had other stuff. Andre has a matching mask. It was supposed to be mine and he ended up keeping it and he loved it. So then I spotted this canister. We usually keep Carl's food just in his, in the bag that it comes in. And I feel like it looks really messy. And I thought that could be perfect. And napkins at HomeSense, Home Goods winners are always the best value. Like they're the cutest and the best. And I have like a lemon theme going on right now. So I thought that'd be perfect for Margarita clock. We're rolling, we're rocking and rolling. And I figured the napkins could go in the napkin holder. And then I found a cocktail section. I have that wine glass in, I think it says wine on it. And then I found these Ray Dunn. Like there was so many Ray Dunn goodies. I had to decide though, listen, you can't have everything. And I, I saw all of this, stop it. All of the lemon themed stuff after I've decorated the entire house and they had such cute summery things. These cuppies are like little cupcake iridescent cuppies. I'm dead. Just it, there was too much. It was sensory overload. And these little wine glasses, they had pineapple ones and flamingo ones. What? And then an entire little watermelon section. Listen, I was sensory overload. Okay. It was too much. All the summer things were out. Andre was being a trooper, super patient, <laughs> probably wanted to kill me. Oh, and this bottle, look at the little avocado. When this comes out for a Virgo, I'm guessing it'll come out maybe later. I don't know. I hope. I love the black with the gold writing on it. It's so cute. I love a good cuppy, you guys. But every time I buy a new cuppy, I have to get rid of an old cuppy because it's getting to be too much. So from there, we went and checked out. The girl was super nice. She wrapped everything individually and we were on our merry way. And you know that you do well whenever the cashier acknowledges that the stuff is really cute. This was a pretty good haul. I feel like we got a lot of stuff. So I'm going to go through everything that we got with you guys and the prices and just what I'm going to do with it and every single item individually. But it was good. It was a good day. Packed everything in the car and made our way home. All right, let's set up and chat about all of the things. I don't know if you guys have winners where you're from. So a couple of you guys have mentioned that in the UK they have it. They definitely have it in Canada and a couple places in the States. I don't know. You guys let me know where you're from and if you guys have a winner. So most of the things that I got are all for this room and everything was from winners. So I will share that and I'm going to set up and chat with you guys. Hopefully you guys can see. Can you see this? Can you see this monstrosity right here? This is our pool. 
that was delivered and it's we're redoing the entire backyard <sighs> it's been it's been documented this was like airlifted <laughs> by crane over our house it was slightly stressful but it's been like a whole ordeal we have like floor plans and everything for the backyard super excited about it honestly it's going to be completely transformed we're going for like ultra ultra modern and very clean tons of privacy which will be sweet so i'm excited all right so first thing we had to wear obviously our masks which are in the video as we are shopping so i'm gonna like literally take you shopping with me today but i had to share these they're super cute they're really lightweight and they're like a tie-dye material so this was supposed to be for me and andre ended up grabbing it so it's like his and hers so cute does anybody else feel like when you pull these out of your pocket or your purse it looks like you have like a set of underwear that you're that's how i feel but i love those are really soft super lightweight very very fabulous now last week i went to winners and i picked up a couple of cuppies which i shared on my stories and you guys were like what and i feel like the filter completely diminished how beautiful this is, this is like a hot pink like iridescent perfect for rum punch which is going to go down today and I love this so I don't know if the glare is too it says wine yeah there you go you can see it so it's a little Ray Dunn insulated wine cup there's like this lid on it that hopefully I can oh my gosh it's suctioned so tight so it's it's metal inside obviously stainless steel and obviously do not microwave hand wash Ooh, Andre's gonna hate that he hates whenever I buy things that can only be hand washed because they just stay in the side sink drying forever okay so let's let's do this let's jump into this so at winners they actually had a lot they're starting to replenish and restock everything which makes me so happy so i'm going to give you guys a little behind the scenes view right now does this make a nice thumbnail this is literally all i do for a thumbnail at the end of the video i usually just like pose or grab a still of me yammering <laughs> we shall see okay so let's let's do this don't you love whenever they ask you would you like this wrapped would you like it in bags? Yes. Because I don't know how I'm going to carry all of this with my bare hands. Truth. Okay. Oh my gosh. Can we talk about something else also? It's just going to be like the complaint central. When, when they give you hand sanitizer and there is like a, like a lake in your hands. Like I didn't need that much. Sorry. Okay. This came off look it says organic so i needed a bunch of i needed a, i needed a bunch of pots for my plants so this was 19.99 keep in mind canadian so freaking cute there was like a whole area of these i love 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 and listen i'm starting to become like a little bit brave here with plants so i have i have my plants that are still growing if you didn't see my summer decor haul I think that's the one where I talk about like all the different plants that I got and how I planted them and did I, I got the plants and I planted them and I feel like so like oh I did good but they're growing and they're still alive so we have sunflowers we have dwarf sunflowers tomatoes and basil and then a bunch of different herbs we'll see how it goes they're they have they're they have happiness okay there's more this is basically all like garden summer right done I love it look at how cute so it says live love and plant oh and it, it has a little plate on the bottom so i'm going to unwrap all of this and put some little individual plants in there how much was this 24.99 that's their magic number there's so many things that are priced 24.99 okay you go here there's a spider kind of half staring at me and it's making me nervous Ooh, oh so the total of everything that we got was two hundred and six dollars Canadian. And I want to get some more. A lot of the plants in this room that like you can see hanging a lot are from Michaels. They're just fake succulents, which seems to work for me since the green thumb is not strong with this one. I struggled. I was like, yes. Now, here's the question. Do I use it as an actual watering can? I think I should because it, it is a true water do, 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 do. um yeah i bought a mister for my plants it didn't work very well i feel like this is way cuter and i could just actually keep the water in here yes love yes we are doing that how much was how much were you dear sir 16.99 i hit the ray dunn jack 
hot. So yeah, they're starting to restock a lot of the stores. Like for a while there, especially Marshalls and HomeSense were completely just like decimated. It's almost like all shoppers just really, really wanted to go out and spend money once they were out of quarantine. So I think they went straight to HomeSense. It was like crazy lineups. Was there lineups where you guys are? There was definitely lineups where we were. I didn't even bother. I was like, we're, I don't need to go to HomeSense that badly. Except for that one time that we, we were like, the first ones in the store, you skip. Oh, that scared the crap. Just my dog. Kara, how'd you get even get out here, bro? You want to say hello? You know that the camera's rolling. Oh my god, it literally it felt like a squirrel or something was behind me. It was just in fact Carl, and he's here because the camera's rolling, and you're a little bit of a camera hug. You're a star. Put your fix your bow tie. You guys, the cutest thing ever was delivered yesterday for Carl. I'm gonna share it on his Instagram as well as mine. It's epic go see it if you've seen it you got it go comment below when you know it you'll know it you'll know when you see it hey you guys can follow carl on his instagram if you would like he's quite fabulous i feel like you're just here and you're like hello all righty oh this this is actually super oily and i want to make sure that it doesn't leak everywhere i had seen this last time when i went to pick up the cuppies which this is why you have plastic outside so it doesn't break. When I went to pick up these, I, f I saw this and I really wanted it. And it was still there when we went back. They actually had like three of them. I just thought it was so on point. So it's a basically a really large and it's almost like rope. Yeah, you can kind of see like it's, it looks like rope and it's, it's distressed and it is a outdoor crafted ceramic sea salt citronella candle. So this paper obviously is gonna come off. Come sa and then it's going to sit on this table. And I feel like that is beautiful for evenings, but it was, you know what? We're not gonna put that on there and we're gonna keep it away from the puppy. Eh? Cause I'm pretty sure you can't be near that. There's certain oils and certain scents. Like I know tea tree, pretty sure citronella is one of them. They just can't be around that, right? Yeah. Can you guys see them down there? You're just, you wanna be a part of it all, eh? Oh, there's things in here for you. Yeah, I always keep you in mind, buddy. Every single time we go through the dog section, I'm like, does Carl need more treats? Andre's like, no, we just need more treats. Every single time. This I thought was so cute. And I had seen it earlier in the season and I, it wasn't summer yet. So I was like, why do I need this? But I like that it has a little stand. So this next to the organic one, so cute with some succulents. Yo, bro, don't touch my mask. And don't touch my candle. It's probably bad for you. Here, go up here. Do, 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 do. <laughs> you stay there. Sit. Now you can distract everyone. So yeah, it says bloom. I'm gonna take off the little rope and everything, but I love that there's a little wooden stand. I feel like that's so cute. But yeah, it wasn't summer yet whenever I had first seen it, so I wasn't into it. But with the succulents from Michaels and everything, yas. Yes. How much how much were you, little friend? $24.99. I'm telling you, Canadians. Cause it's Canadian dollars. So I feel like Americans, you guys probably have your own target number. What would that be equal to? I want to say like $16.99, probably less. Our dollar is terrible. That was obnoxious. This, oh, did that spook you? I'm sorry. This, I died. It had a little bit of Disney flair to it, which I'm all about. Okay, you're being really pushy just so you know, bro. It says grow. It's a cuppy. It's a large mug. Does this not have all of the Alice in Wonderland vibes of life? I'm gonna put a plant in here. Whenever, you know what, you know when you do well at home sense or winners, when you get to the cash and the cashier goes, oh my God, this is so cute. You know you did well if that happens. I'm gonna put this right here. I am obsessed with that. Isn't that the cutest thing? I just feel like it has like a lot of Mad Hatter Disney vibes. Okay. Oh, how much were you, dear friend? I'll give you one guess. $24.99. Oh my gosh. It doesn't even make sense. There's some that are like smaller, bigger, anyways. And I wonder how much this was. Let's put a wager. How much do we think that this next piece was? Oh, there's stuff in here. Okay, let's start with let's start with the tin. So this is for you, buddy. Can you tell? 
I needed a canister for his food and I just thought this this totally fits like how our house is decorated like with the wood and the metal and everything so there's like a little dog bone on here how do you know that this is for you you look too excited so we can put all of his kibbles in here so that it's not just like a loose bag I feel like the smell of dog food is just not pleasant and it's in our front entrance closet and I don't want my coat to smell like it okay I know everyone's waiting let's see how much it was it's $24.99 <laughs> I feel like they just have a $24.99 little price tag and they go bloop, 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 and they don't even look at it. Was everything? Oh, this is $16.99. That's so funny. That's hilarious. Okay, so lid, but I, she packaged this very well. So I wanted to get something like this for either, either out here, which would be fine for margarita clock, or in our washroom. So one thing that we do in our washroom, and I've shared this before, like our guest washroom, because I feel like having you know what, especially now, having a common towel in our guest washroom, I don't love it. I don't like it. And I don't like when people use my, my decorative towels. It drives me crazy, especially when they're a Ray Dunn towel. So I started doing, and we don't have that many people over, so I started doing just like paper towels. And not like paper towels, but like little napkins like this. And they can dry their hands so i have something like this in the washroom but i thought this was way nicer but now that i see it i kind of want it for out here so i bought these lemon themed little napkins napkins are the cheapest at home sense and winners they're the best and they're the cheapest and they're just they're my favorite so then this little guy this goes down so that it like does nothing blows away my mom had one of these when i was younger and i loved i just thought it was so smart because then your stuff doesn't blow away whenever you eat outside so I think I'll have this for out here. I feel like it's really cute with the napkin. So the theme for this year is lemon and honey. If you guys haven't seen my decorate with me videos, go check it out for sure. So the little napkin holder was $9.99 and these were $5.99 for the napkins. This is everything that I got. I am, I am so excited. I'm gonna start decorating, I'm gonna put things away and I'll just share like an overall tour. But there is a house tour coming. There is a closet tour coming. Nothing is filmed, but I wanna do that because I know you guys have been asking for that, like an updated house tour with all of the summer decor. And I wanna take you guys through this process with this monstrosity of a pool that I'm staring at right now and just how we're gonna reno the backyard. So I've been documenting everything from when we met with, with the designers, with the gardeners, the landscapers, um, the people that are gonna install the, the pool and everything. Like it's, for such a small backyard, it's a big to-do. So I'm excited. It's been a task and a half. It's making me appreciate the people at Disney, to be honest, because they have been a breeze and I also feel like we need an updated Disney video just because there's so much progress happening on the house there all about the home decor and all about the home updates so if this was fun for you guys and you guys enjoyed definitely give this video a thumbs up if you guys want to see more hauls like this and if you guys truly do enjoy them because I enjoy doing them let me know down below and you guys share with me what what did you like the most what was your favorite piece Definitely the cup. Definitely the cup. All right, well, I'm going to go shake myself up a, a little rum punch in here. And I have a goal setting mastermind that I have on my smaller channel, my vlog channel, where we're basically going to go through for like about 45 minutes of goal setting. So that will probably go live on the same day as you see this, which will probably be today because homegirl is hustling over here and trying to edit and upload videos as quickly as I possibly can because I know you guys want to see them. I love, I love hanging out with you guys. It truly is like an honor. It brings me so much joy. I love the heck out of you guys and I will see you next time. Bye dudes.